go. I'm playing with all the filters right now, you guys. Sorry. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I've had so many brands before and I still have the Passport to Beauty brand is because the government of India had asked me to find a way to create impact. And I thought beauty being such a universal language, um, you know, there was no better way to use beauty for a higher purpose, create a brand and take part of the proceeds to skill these underprivileged girls. But then during the pandemic, we realized that girls all over the world were like losing their jobs. They were furloughed. They were having mental health issues, um, you know, wanting to learn more self-care. So we decided to add an online academy where you can not only um, get great personal development, but also professional skills. And we're super excited. We'll be launching that in September. That's really exciting. So, um, you know, what are some things that you think like you want to include in the academy besides just like, you know, beauty? Because um, that's great. But like, do you want to do like yoga, mental health? Like, is it going to be like an all around 360? Like 100%. What? So like, I mean, if for those of you who have followed my career or haven't, I launched a women's platform in 2016 at the United Nations. Oh, wow. Called Power Beauty, uh, Power Beauty Living. Oh, you guys I have a cough because it's like, so windy okay. and hot here. I had the opportunity to meet him when I was shooting all the Hungarian beauty secrets and he's phenomenal. So you can literally buddy set jet to Budapest and get to work with him. And then of course you Lily um, and you know, just experts from all over the world. So again, there's a lot of that personal development, like what are you doing for self care? What are you doing for mindset? What are you doing, you know, to take care of yourself? And then there's all that professional um, side where it's like how to become a professional makeup artist, how to become a celebrity makeup artist, what, what do you need in your kit? How to become a content creator? How to develop your personal brand? So these are everything that we're gonna offer in the Ready, Set, Jet Academy. So if you were not yourself, right? Okay. Um, what would you be most excited for? Because I know for me, um, believe it or not, the yoga is actually kind of exciting or like the mental health because um, I think like three years ago when I went to a <coughs> yoga class, there were like babies crying and it was like, this is yoga. <laughs> So I, I that like was a wrong class. Tran <laughs> yeah, I like tranquility uh, within my own home. So um, actually, I'm pretty excited for that. What about you? Yeah, I mean, like look, self care. You. Self care is the older I get, the more I realize like how important it is to take care of of this, like your mindset, take care of yourself, and that really like when you, it kind of goes hand in hand. When you look good, you feel good, but when you feel good, you look good as well because you want to take care of yourself. So for me, I think um, that's really exciting. I love the entrepreneurship empowerment and excellence because you know for me, my entire mission has always been about yeah. creating equal opportunities for women. So I feel like being able to have a place where there's resources. I mean, there wasn't that when I was starting my career, right? Like I did it by myself. I couldn't find other women that wanted to help me. They were just bitches, to be honest. I mean, <laughs> you know, they weren't like very supportive development. So that's what the $18 a month does. And then you're part of a really big community. So you can get to meet like minded people in the community, you're able to talk oh, to them. I'm good. I'm good. Hi. How are you guys? We're good. Oh, Hi, Shalini. Nice to see you. We are having... How are Hi, you? I'm, I live in Delhi, India. Oh, that's really How is, cool. How's everything going in Delhi now with COVID? Yeah. Or is it getting better? Yeah, the conditions are getting better oh, okay. every day. Good, good. Well, we're so excited. I had a talk with you at DM. Shalini, do you remember? Course, we met during yeah. the startup so grind. Um, Lily, I was a speaker at Startup Grind Delhi. And um, okay. and then she reached out to me after seeing my talk. So. Oh, that's really sweet. Yeah. Oh, cool. I just, Women can do any fucking thing they want. <laughs> okay, I want to, like to remove that stigma that women can't be entrepreneurs or they can't own companies, they can't be competent to do something like, we could do anything, okay? At the end of the day, we're all human, we're all people. So I think um, through the you know academy, I do wanna see that. I, I wanna oh, see that stigma like, be crushed, just crush it, burn. <laughs> no, you're right though. I mean, I've gone into so many meetings in my career, Lily, where I've walked in, I'm, I'm usually 90, 95% of the time, I'm usually the only woman in a funding meeting or in a boardroom. And what's so exciting about Ready, Set, Jet is we have 90% female investors.